it really didn't bother me until I actually had my son. And then I wondered who was going to help him with his homework and who was going to read to him. Sharice Oakman struggles with reading and writing. I really had an attitude. I had an attitude against my mother, and I had an attitude against the school. But the biggest attitude I had was against myself. If somebody had walked up to me and said, Sharice, right off the top of your head, give me five good things about yourself, not clout and being the mother, I couldn't do it. Once I got rid of all the shame, the door seemed to open up for me. I can't believe how this literacy program has changed my life. So I decided I'm going to do this pleasure reading thing. And the book that I got and was Frankenstein. And when I finished the book, it was like having a, a TV screen in color in my head. One day I was driving down the street, I was going to San Rafael, and I was just looking at all the exit signs and, you know, and, and I thought to myself, I said, good Lord, Cherise. I said, a few years ago, you couldn't read any of these signs. You got to be ready for this. You can't do it for your mother. You can't do it for your spouse. You can't even do it for your children. I said, you have to do it for yourself. This is a brand new day for you. Just come in this door, and, and once we give you a tutor, just let yourself grow. Libraries change lives.